Good morning, Rody Fruity fam. This is what we're dealing with in New England right now in Rhode Island. Look at this. Oh, gross. This is just the beginning of it. Literally every place is closed. Let's see if McDonald's is open here. I have no idea if they are or not. Okay, I just went over a medium because the guy didn't really do a really good job of plowing. All right, let's see what's going on here. Also, fam, <laughs> when you're from New England or Rhode Island or anywhere where it snows a lot, I think that they give you these at birth. So these are like super essential, the L.L. Bean uh, kind of duck boots. These, man, I would not survive New England winters without these. All right, familia, here we go, here we go, baby. The big breakfast with hotcakes. Look at that, they hooked me up too, man. Scissor, I didn't even know that they had a strawberry. I grew up with this. By the way, I haven't had this, guys, in over a decade, so I'm excited to chomp down on this. Also, look at this. Salt and pepper? Yo, this, and look at this bag. It's like a shopping bag. <laughs> oh, man. All right, guys, I'm starving, man. Let's get into the video. Good morning, Roddy Fruity fam, guys. We are in the midst of a little storm here in Rhode Island. Um, so I was driving around trying to find a place to park. Let's turn off the car here. Uh, first of all, guys, I had to wake up like half hour, 45 minutes before even trying to go out trekking into the world for my hunts for food. Um, so I was going to do a local restaurant, uh, for breakfast. They, they were, they were closed because of the storm. So I drove, I was like, oh, where haven't I had breakfast in a while? We did the BK thing. Ooh. Right. And then I, I remember I haven't had Taco Bell breakfast. So I went over there, they're closed. So I was like, there's one place that's never closed. Mickey D's baby and uh <laughs> and sorry I'm getting a text message at the same time here uh so Mickey D's and I was like what on the Mickey D's menu have I had not have had in a long time the big breakfast here we go baby hot cakes arena all the all the fixings scissor and like you guys saw in the intro I didn't even know that they freaking had this man so let's get into this you guys know the rules gotta wet the whistle Oh, man, if you guys knew, I earned this breakfast today, by the way. And there is something therapeutic. I don't care what anybody tells you. There is something, uh, there's something about manual labor. <laughs> You're going to be like, Loop, unless you have to do it every day. I, I get that aspect of it. But um, shoveling and everything else, I got like, I kind of miss going to the gym, guys. I haven't been, in the, obviously, I haven't gone to the gym in over a year. Uh, because of COVID, well, like nine months. I was trying to go for a while, but then the restrictions got crazier, crazier, and crazier. So uh, once everything lifts, your boy's going to go back. You know what I mean? The gun show is that way. The mukbangs are that way. I'll meet you over here and then I'll meet you over here. Okay. Big breakfast down the hatch. Let's go. Uh, happy Thursday, everybody. I need silverware. All right. I like to kind of segment this. And for everybody who's like, Loop, you have to be in the mood for hash browns. What are you, a lunatic? Guess what? I'm in the mood for hash browns today. Cheers. Mm. I remember as a kid. Can you guys even see? I remember as a kid. I don't know. Ugh, these biscuits, man, sometimes are super, super dry. But I remember as a kid. Like, you were lucky. You were super lucky if you got the, the big breakfast. It means like I was out of, uh, like you're sick from school. <laughs> you're like, you want, you want to get some, uh, you want to get some McDonald's? Be like, yes, please. All right. Ooh, these are actually like not dry. I think it's because I'm the only person here. Guys, I'm literally the only person out on the streets. Everyone else is like, I guess everyone else in Rhode Island doesn't have a... A McBang channel. Mm. I am going to call around, though, because I do want to do one local restaurant today, though. I don't know where it's going to be. I'm thinking maybe... What are you guys in the mood for? Oh. Actually, you know what? I think snowstorms are probably the days to go to McDonald's for breakfast, man. Because 
everything right now is super funky fresh. This is probably the best, the best. I don't know what happened to my fork or my knife. Oh, here we go. Guys, I'm all over the place. Oh, all right, here we go. Little butter. Oh yeah. And I like to make little taquitos out of these. You're like, Loop, you can't make everything into Mexican food. Watch me, son! Watch me. Also, guys, all right, let, yeah, so let's get into some topics. So, uh, first, I got an email this morning from uh, the Mover mover and, and, and Shaka's thing, the Hawaiian thing. And I was like, oh, my God. Oh, my God. Am I going to Hawaii? <laughs> <coughs> it was literally just an email to say, hey, we got your application. I was like, all right. Well, that was a tease. Guys, it is, it is, it is crazy out here how much snow there is. We've definitely had more snow than this, I remember, but all right, here we go. Taquito time. Can I get a taquito, por favor? All right, here you go, fam. You don't even need to put salt and pepper if you have the sausage on there. It's enough saltiness for the game. Here we go. Fusion food. McDonald's Mexican food. <laughs> McDonald's Mexican fusion food. Going crazy in the snow. Only place open. Down the hatch. Mmm. That's a good biscuit. Oh, my God. The only silver lining to all this huge snowy mess. You get a fresh McDonald's breakfast. That is such a good biscuit. You bite into these, man, they, they taste like rocks usually. Mm. Wow. Wow. So I got the email. <laughs> Guys, I'm <clears throat> I'm in bed. I pull it up this morning, and instantly I have to pee. I'm like, oh my god! So I pee first, and then I and then I read it, and I was like, damn man, that's all right. <sighs> so we'll see. Again, they're only picking fifty people. And basically in the email, they're like, whoa, we were overwhelmed with so many applicants. I was like, all right. This is like the pre-breakup. You know the pre-breakup? When someone starts acting funny, you're like, mm, I've been here before. The pre-breakup. Been there before. Wow. You guys, make yourself a little big breakfast. Breakfast. Tostadas, I meant, not taquitos. Tostadas. Does does McDonald's have salsa? Should I ask them for some salsa? A little cholula or a little El Tapatio right there. Put it right down the hatch. Mmm. Mm-hmm. Also, guys, tomorrow, Friday, I'm going to be ordering some more things for the car. I'm really excited. The, the biggest purchase is going to be anybody who camps a lot or... or um, kind of knows about like generators and power banks and stuff like that will know what this is but for the folks that don't it's called a jackery so a jackery is basically like this it's basically a huge portable battery and it's about this big they have different kinds right for the different uh, um, power needs that you have I'm going to start with the super humble one because I want to learn about I, I'm still trying to figure out how to convert watts and amps and and what do I need to be pulling and and the output and the input and all that jazz. So I'm, I'm teaching myself. Anybody have any websites where it's like for dummies? 
something I can print and like just put in my wallet and like just refer to it anytime, uh, please let me know. Comment down below. But uh, the Jackery comes, it's like this little battery and you can either power it by solar uh, through a wall or through your cigarette lighter. Um, kind of acts like a, as an inverter. Um, but it's basically like it can it can power my phone like a gazillion times if I need to power my laptop. It's things that people have in their house for like snowstorms and stuff like that. But a lot of folks that go camping or road trips, car camping, van life, nomadic life, they have it in their car so that they can always be charging all their stuff. Um, and some of them, the, like the, the hardcore folks, put a freaking solar panel on the top of their car. Hmm. When I was driving around town the other day, I saw this Asian restaurant that I've never heard of in my entire life. So that's the restaurant. <laughs> I can't even, it's one of those restaurant guys that I've probably driven past it a gazillion times. I know it's there. Well, I'm sorry, I know it's there now. The only word that I could see on the outside was Thai. So I think I'm gonna try that video for our local video. Um, I don't know if I'll post that today and or post it tomorrow, but I think that that will be our local restaurant today. <clears throat> I was gonna go back to Wendy's today to try some of their other breakfast items, but guys, it is, sometimes when it snows like this, you have to stay within like a quarter mile of your house. And it's like this. Since we've been in here, it's just, you can't even see out. I mean, it's just, it's it's a storm, baby. So, um, and I'll try to do, I, I've done all the local restaurants like around me. Um, there's probably, I'm sure that there's a handful of more, but most of them are pizzerias. Um, so we'll, we'll try those too, especially if the storm's gonna be really, really bad. I have been craving like a steak and cheese though. All I gotta say. All right, this got hard. Done. This, we're gonna make a little shish kebab here. All right, boom, that, that. Get that in there. This is gonna be the money bite. Like, Loop, you haven't done a money bite in a while. I know. Here we go. Like, Lou, you are a complete maniac. Guys, I know I'm not normal. All right, here we go. Ugh. That's okay. Down the hatch. Mm-hmm. I'm going to take a nap after this. So... I think that'll be that today's video. If they happen to be closed, obviously, dang. Um, I'm gonna have to think of something else for you guys today. Cause I do kind of want to post two videos today. Um, I know that I have that big pizza slice. Maybe we'll do the big pizza slice. Do I have cheese? Yeah. Pepperoni, jalapenos. I can caramelize some onions. Oh my God. <sighs> Foodie fam, there might be, might be a pizza video. I've been wanting to do that, that freaking big slice. It's been sitting in my office forever. It doesn't need to be refrigerated or anything like that. All right, these, these we're gonna do like taquitos. That's what I meant to say. You know what, I gotta try this. Guys, I'm such a scatterbrain today. There we go. Oh, that's good. Damn it, I should have saved this. I don't know if I was gonna use it just for that. Damn it. All right. Here we go, Familia. Snowmageddon 2020. It's not that bad outside. I mean, it's pretty bad, but we've, been, we've, we've had some worse winters here. 
the one good thing that I love about this little Subaru that I have too, it's all wheel drive, baby. My pancakes got cold. Oh no, no, they're warm underneath. We're gonna dip it. What breakfast title? Why hasn't Taco Bell come out with something like this? Loop, don't give him any ideas. Mmm. You know, back when IHOP was good, they used to, uh, I remember as a kid going in, right, you would go in, you would sit down, and then you'd have like the 10,000 syrups, you're like, oh my God, I'm going to taste every single one. Not bad little pancake. Hmm. All right, we'll eat one more and then I'll let you guys go. If you live in the Northeast, please be safe. I only left my house because I had to film for my foodie fam. Because I really don't have that much. Oh my God. I think I have the stuff. Hold on. Oh my God, I think I have the stuff in my house to make some ceviche. Fam, I think I have the stuff in my house to make ceviche. That might be a video. Look, cooking slash McBang video. This is all sugar. I don't know why I'm doing this. Isn't it pick me up? You know why? Because I have to go back home. I, I only... Sh uh, I uh, shoveled enough, like, my front driveway so that the mail person can come, right? And also Amazon. Um, walked around. <coughs> oh, my God. I almost just died. Sorry, Rody Foodie fam. <coughs> the preserve or whatever the heck this is. What is this? Yeah, the preserves and the <coughs> syrup went back there as I was breathing because I was trying to talk obviously the whole point of this channel oh my god hey don't <clears throat> and uh oh my god all right I'm steaming beaming over here I forgot what I was gonna say basically I think I, I was gonna say that uh that we were gonna do possibly a, a tostada making video Local YouTube personality. Found choking in a McDonald's parking lot. <clears throat> I mean, the article writes itself, right? All right, guys. I love you so much. Again, be safe if you live in the New England states or if you live in uh, kind of area where you're getting some inclement weather. I'm going back home. It's just... It's a winter wonderland out here. Um, be well, eat well, and take care of each other. Ciao.